All right, I'm here at Sea Dragon, and I'm here with Melissa. Melissa, you want to tell me a little bit about your operations, charters? Hi, I'm Melissa from Sea Dragon Charters. We have two boats. We have one boat in Nanaimo, so you can Which go... is the one right behind you here. That's right, this okay. one. We hold 10 divers over there. Uh-huh. And there's many wrecks you can do over there. We have the Rivto Lion, the Saskatchewan, the Cape Breton, the Mackenzie, Lots of wrecks, amazing wreck penetration and diving there. What um, uh, wreck do we have down here? That is the Cape Breton. Okay, that went before it went down. Yes. Now it's been down about 10 years it's been down, hasn't it? Yes, it's been down for about 10 Quite years Quite a while, now. so it's got yes. a lot of, uh, actually in the first year or two it had a lot of wildlife on it. Yes, it does. And now it, you, we've got another boat that's down in Vancouver or up in Vancouver. Yes, this is our top line. We run out of Horseshoe Bay in Howard Horseshoe Sound. Bay. Okay. We can hold up to 20 divers there. So from Seattle that's an easy drive up to Horseshoe yes, Bay. Yes, two hours. Two hours. Hours max. And then you're gonna um, some of the dives you see there is all oh, the natural beauty underwater. Yes. And then this boat down here. This is the Annapolis. It oh, has not it, been sunk yet. It's We're, ready to go. Yes. Almost ready almost. to go. They've been working on that for quite a while, so that'll be a nice yes. addition to all the boats that you have down there. When the Annapolis gets sunk, it will bring much, 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 so many, so many things to uh, Horseshoe Bay. <laughs> well, actually, having the uh, the Brenton and and the other boat there um, bring a lot um, up that way and then for Horseshoe that will be a big plus. Yes. And Horseshoe's a nice little town if they haven't been up there uh, yes. before yes. where the bay is, it is. And then we've got some pictures of some of the other stuff. Sculpins, uh, basket and enemies, and the divers. This is getting off the one in uh, Nanaimo. Nanaimo. They're yes, getting um, Nanaimo. right off the boat to go diving. So they just sit on the back and jump right in the water. Yes. And uh, most of the dive trips are uh, one or two uh, dives? Two dives, yes. Okay. And it, so they're in the water, or they take off from the, um, what, the bay at what time? The bay usually um, 8.30 we leave. Okay, and you're back by sometime in the afternoon? 1.30. 1.30 in the yes. afternoon. So it doesn't even take the whole day. Probably the same out in Nanaimo, too, if the yes. weather's good. 8.30 a.m. we'd like to leave in the, in the morning. Okay, off the record, which is your favorite, the Nanaimo or the Vancouver? Uh, I shouldn't ask. Nanaimo. Really? Is that hometown? Uh, no, okay. I'm from Vancouver. Okay. Uh, oh, it's really? my favorite because uh, I really enjoy wreck penetration and deep diving. Okay. So anything that's more technical and it's going to be a little bit more risky, that's what I like doing. Okay, so <laughs> if you li like more technical, Nanaimo, and if you like uh, more recreational, uh, you got the Vancouver. Actually, you can't go wrong either way, I think. That's right. Okay, well, thank you very much for thank your time. Thank you.